Okay now, so the things you need to start. A rubber hurdy-gurdy. Yeah, kind of, you know, important for... A bag of these. You find a link to buy these in the description below. Then, these usually come with a bag of screws. Also, you will have to buy separately a few rings, a few metal rings like these. Uh, these can be bought basically anywhere. Uh, I, I, I don't know the exact size, but the important thing is that they are large and that they fit with the hole of the, of the tuner. More precisely, you should check that when you screw out these, you should, you should find yourself with one ring and the second ring, the big one, should fit, I mean, th this part should fit into the big ring and of course all the rest, you know. Now why is this important? Because the, the holes that are normally on, the, on these hurdy-gurdies are actually quite large. So, without the ring, this thing would slip away. So, eventually, of course, a few of these. And a screwdriver. Okay, now, first things first, remove your old peg and uh, the strings with it, of course. Ah. Okay, lots of friction. So I take these things, now the, you will find the link to buy these in the description of the video. Uh, nonetheless, of course, you can try different ones. These are guitar tuners. These are easy to find and also very cheap. Okay, as so you unscrew this, uh, you have to take this part away. Then, when you put this inside, you will probably not be able to turn the tuner because of the attrition with the, this part of the, of the neck. Uh, in case, no, no, try this, you put this inside and then, uh, without using the screw as yet, just try to turn the thing and if it actually turns well, well, you, you are right. If, for example, on, on, on this hole, you probably won't be able to turn it. If so, well, first of all, change hole, if possible. Or, grab a piece of sandpaper and try to sand the edges until you're fine, until this actually turns. I take one of these rings Okay, let's pull this in uh, at the, the, the big ring First, then the smaller ring. Eventually, the screw thing. You should reach a, a point where this is actually needed. Always take care. Now, this can actually slide a bit. Be sure that you pull pommel up and this can actually turn on itself only then you need a lot of pressure here otherwise the strings will eventually move okay my string, insert it in the smaller hole. Please remember that with these tuners uh, you won't be able to use perhaps very thick strings. Now I, I, I can use a gut string all right and this is rather thick. Now the last thing to do is to actually a screwdriver and <coughs> I used a very small screw that actually came with the bag, okay? And now 
you would see there is a very tiny hole in here on the on the corner of the tuner. Okay, cool, so we're done. That's it. Thanks for watching.